Hey guys, it's Jay. Welcome to my kitchen in New York City. Today, we are gonna make a 15 minute warm, sweet, and spicy meal just like life. We are gonna make coconut curry island mussels. Yum, yum, yum. Hey, like always friends, we are going to cut and chop everything in the ingredient section so that we can be stress-free in the kitchen and hear the sizzle and sing and dance. Okay, so I sizzled one red onion with some olive oil, salt, and pepper for about two minutes to get it translucent, which just means it's clear, but not brown. And then we're gonna add five cloves of garlic and it's gonna stick to these mussels and you're gonna get a big garlicky kiss. And Fresno chilies that are sweet and spicy and two tablespoons of butter, my favorite creamy friend. Okay, I'm gonna duck down because I'm in my New York City kitchen, but here is the secret flavor ingredients. You can get this in your international food aisle. One can of coconut milk, full fat, and then Thai red curry paste that is sweet, spicy, and it's this warm hug that you get around those muscles. Okay, onesies, twosies right there. Oh, and here comes the coconut milk. Ah, look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, when it sizzles like that, you know you've done something right, and I'm gonna mix this around. And we're gonna lower the heat to a simmer for five minutes so all those flavors can mingle together and love each other. All right, guys, get in there. Uh, three pounds of mussels. Okay, we're gonna mix this all around. Cover it for five minutes on medium. We're gonna have a sweet, Spicy, creamy, delicious dinner, yay! Coconut curry island mussels. Okay, so we're gonna add some beautifulness to this. Some of that lime zest is gonna add a big burst of sunshine. A big pop of mint on top as well too. Oh yes, and my favorite thing, some crunch. We're gonna put some cashews in there as well too. Go on to chophappy.com for the recipe and to YouTube to watch the video. All right, here we go. Mm. Oh my God, it's a little briny from the ocean. And then you get that creamy coconut flavor on oh, the spice at the ends from that curry. Yay, 